Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Come away with us this weekend to Derbyshire. It is the 16th of December and we are travelling up to see Gareth's dad today. So on the way there we have obviously stopped out the services. The kids have requested a snack because they were hungry so they've all wanted a donut from Greg's. I had a salted caramel latte which was really delicious and the kids all had a sweet treat. So after that little pit stop we can get back onto the road and carry on with our journey now as you can see it is like a winter wonderland it, everything was just covered in snow all the fields all the trees it was so beautiful the kids have all been super excited to come away this weekend and see granddad and if you do like this content and any of my other videos do give me a big uh, thumbs up on the video consider subscribing to my channel i would love to have you over there we finally arrived at Gareth's dad's house. There's been a couple of stops along the way, but everybody has been very good in the car. Yeah, it's a bit icy, guys. Just be careful. You're doing your magazine, aren't you? You're making the snow globe. And your LOL magazine. What are you making, Charlie? Um, a pet. A pet? You're making a pet. Lovely. Zach was the only one mad enough to want to play outside in the freezing cold weather. So we are all settled in. We've all had some lunch and a drink. The kids are playing. Zach's been outside with the football. And Charlie and Lily are playing with the dolls and the prams. And Charlie's had the cars out. Um, this morning we stopped off at Tesco on our way to Derbyshire. Because yesterday my coat broke. I picked it up. I noticed there was a big rip in the seam. So for those of you that um, pay close attention to my videos, you'll notice I'm wearing a new coat. Um, I got it from Tesco's and quite chuffed with it, it's really nice, it was £49, but I can, and you need a coat, it's so cold at the moment, you cannot go out without a coat on, so that was what we did on the way here, and the kids all bought a magazine or something, toy thing, to keep them amused in the car and to do this weekend, so Charlie and Lily have been playing with that, and I think Zach got football cards, but, um, so we're just chilling out, Gareth's helping his dad with a couple of things, I think we're going to go out somewhere a bit later on possibly um and we're having a lovely roast dinner this evening so that will be nice all right we're going out don't know where but we're going out okay. zach's really oh, happy about it, it well yeah that's why we've got seven seats zach we took a drive over to a local town and parked at the train station just to see if there was anything interesting going on there. Um, unfortunately there wasn't, so um, we just went for a little walk up the road, the kids had a look at the train track and then we went and got back in the car. I would have liked to have gone for a bit of a walk but we were losing daylight so that just made it tricky. So we did decide just to go back home after that. So there's nothing going on at the station, uh, but quite often there are steam trains and things. So there's lots of stations around here. Um, don't you dare! Honestly, these children. Uh, and Lily's having a bit of a paddy whack because she wants ice cream. And apparently I never buy her ice cream. So she's having a moan, so I've given her to Gareth. I've got a lovely little Christmas tree in at the station. Obviously got stuff going on over the weekend. Just got two out of three children in a bad mood, which is lovely. So it's nice when you've got a happy family, isn't it? So this is where we are. We hopped back in the car and decided to call it a day to go home. We are on the drive home through the town, there were lots of shop fronts that were lit up all for Christmas, and it did look really beautiful. What is that there? No, that's yeah. old, isn't it? It's all really old. Dude. We are home. It is what time is it? Yeah, Twenty past five. We went for a little drive into Worksworth. Went to Worksworth train station, but there wasn't really anything going on there. 
had just a little wander around for a few minutes um and then got in the car and came home so we didn't really do anything um when we got home zach and gareth were playing football in the back garden and zach fell over um and whacked the top of his thigh on the corner of like a paving slab and he's hurt his leg he's got like a nasty bruise and a graze on there and he's in, he was really upset crying for a long time about it um but i've given him some medicine and he's got like a cold wet flannel on there um and now lily wants a bath so i'm running her a bath but she's crying her eyes out because she hasn't got any bath toys um so it's all fun and games really here i'm just hoping that they're tired and that tomorrow they'll be in a better mood so the two younger ones are all bathed and then we decided we would head over to the pub for a couple of drinks while the roast dinner was cooking. So Gareth and his dad had a couple of the festive ales that the pub had in stock and me and the kids also had a drink and it was just nice to sit and chill for half an hour before heading home. And once we got home it just smelled so delicious of roast chicken dinner and we had a lovely evening eating and chatting and just sitting around the table which was really nice. I hope that you've enjoyed the first day of our festive weekend in Derbyshire and thank you for watching. Do subscribe if you enjoyed it and stay tuned for the other one.